All right, we are live, guys. What is going on? It's Brando Linux here coming at you with another video. And this is going to be candid. And the whole reason why you're going to want to pay attention is when it comes to sales, like selling online, selling on Etsy. And I want to use Etsy as an example. Um, I don't use Etsy, I'm not affiliated with Etsy, but having used to actually use Etsy, um, having used to use like eBay, Amazon to sell different things, drop shipping, buying low, selling high. And having been able to since 2014 create a full-time internet lifestyle business all right without having to work a job I was able to fire my boss there's some practical tips I can give you guys and one of the best that most people will not share with you that you can apply to Etsy as an example in this video to actually sell is figuring out what you're offering all right what is it you're offering who is the niche you're offering it to is it for men is it for females how old all right what's your demographic okay you need to analyze who your product is really for if you don't have a product I would recommend looking into affiliate marketing where you can actually not have to create a product which is really cool you don't actually have to create a product and service you can resell the product and service other people have created to make money so for example instead of taking your time to make things all right, which limits you. If you're in business or getting an online business to have a lifestyle where you can, you know, spend time with your family, retire your husband, retire your wife, be able to travel more. If you're always creating products, you will never have time. If you're always creating products, you will never have time. Okay? Does that make sense? Okay, I hope that makes sense. I hope that's coming through. Because if you're always doing that, you're always the result of having to create something which means the more customers you get, that's awesome, you make a lot of money, but the more you're gonna have to produce, the more everything is on you, especially if it's a unique product that you're creating, okay, that means you probably won't hire other people to help you create it, because it's unique, it's yours, it's something that you created, so you only really trust your gut and yourself to create it. You're limiting yourself and your business if you're building a business online that way, all right? So a good way to do it if you are not creating something, and don't have a product that was just like a side note and rant for uh, people who are creating stuff okay just something to be aware of okay because um, if you're trying to build a business to have a life you're gonna be building a business and not having a life that way so I just want to predicate that but if you're someone who doesn't have a product doing affiliate marketing is really good I highly recommend it for those of you of you who don't have products yet because it's another person who's created a product and service and you can resell that product and service on Etsy you can resell it on any type of website you can create your own website and sell that affiliate product and when you sell it you get paid okay so all you have to do is get people to that product and you make money okay the difference is is you're not having to create it it's already created it's all ready to go the person and the company all right they handle all the creation and delivery and all that stuff all you have to do is get people to it you make money all right that's really really lucrative because then you can actually build a business have a life at the same time but aside from that all right when it comes down to actually selling it identify your product what you're offering identify who it can be for and then from there you need to identify what is your favorite social media I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you why because when it comes down to selling all right you can have the best product in the world you created it or you're selling someone else's as an affiliate but nobody's gonna buy it if you hold it in your hands you have to go out there and pick a marketplace to go market on what's a marketplace Instagram Twitter Facebook Pinterest social media they're all different marketplaces the best tip I can give you guys is utilize one that you use don't utilize one that you don't use and if you don't use any of them find one that you enjoy all right what do you enjoy most Do you enjoy watching YouTube videos Do you enjoy uh, looking through pictures on Instagram do you enjoy reading articles or posts or you know socializing with people go to Facebook or interacting on short posts go to Twitter all right what do you enjoy digesting information on most when it comes to social media use that and focus on one and give free valuable content on there free valuable content why why Brandon? why do you do that because when it comes to selling nobody likes pictures and what everyone is doing who uses Etsy eBay Amazon affiliate products is they take their product and they spam it in Facebook groups they spam it on Pinterest they spam it on Instagram they just post their shit all over the place and that is what it is it's absolute shit there's no value to it nobody likes pitches all right nobody likes it do you like it no so don't do it you've probably been a victim of it and probably you've done it too all right if you're honest with yourself don't do it quit what you want to do is you want to attract people to you how you do that is you give free content free value 
So identify what your product is, who can help, okay, and why it can help them. So if it's a lifestyle product, jewelry product, like who's interested in that kind of stuff? If it's women interested in fashion, make content, videos, how to's on fashion, all right, on this, on that, give tips, how to's, what to do when, what to do when a dress rips, what to do to get a slimmer belly, what to do uh, when it comes to fixing a bracelet, when it comes to fixing a necklace, all right, what to do when it comes to earrings. Like if you're a female and that's your target market, you wanna create free valuable content for that niche because it's probably people who'd be interested in your product. And you're not creating content about your product, you're creating content to the people in that niche and what they're interested in, okay? Does it make sense? It lures them in when you're giving that free content because people like free content and that's how you get people to like know and trust you. And the only way to sell in business is to get people to trust you. People will not buy from people they don't trust, okay? Does it make sense? People will not buy from spammers. People will buy from people who give value because then they're like, damn, this article, this video, I loved it. I feel like I like know, know and trust this person and I wanna spend money with them or I'm interested in what they're offering. They'll actually look at your offer and potentially buy it and that's what you want. So that's my tip guys, I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, before I go, if you're someone who's just wanting to learn how to build a business online, all right, if you're not affiliated with Etsy or even affiliated with Etsy and you're wanting to learn how to be a full-time internet entrepreneur to market yourself, to attract people to you, all right, if that's you so that you can quit your job, you can create time freedom, leverage, independence, financial independence, to do what you wanna do when you wanna do it, I've created a five video training series on my website. It'll be linked right down below. It's 123marketingtips.com. And in that training series, I walk you through exactly step by step how I was able to create a full time internet business from April 2014 to September 2014. After prior to that, working a job at Red Lobster 40 hours a week. So go check it out if you're interested in series about building a business online, being a full time internet entrepreneur. And if not, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care and bye bye.